Today's video is a pain in the butt. We're going to be talking about glutes. The glutes are a group of muscles that are comprised of the gluteus maximus, the gluteus medius, and the gluteus minimus. These three muscles help with movement throughout the hip. The gluteus maximus is the prime mover and oftentimes helps with extension of the hip. Uh, the gluteus medius and minimus are oftentimes seen as stabilizers of the hip. If the stabilizers of the hip are weak, then we often tend to compensate in other areas of the low back and also into the spine. Another muscle that's in this area is the piriformis muscle. The piriformis muscle can be a muscle that causes a lot of pain and symptoms. It can be piriformis syndrome or also associated with sciatica. The glutes are designed to produce power and stability through all kinds of movements. If the glutes aren't functioning properly, whether they're not pr producing enough power or they're not stabilizing the hip properly, then it will cause problems in both the hip, lower extremity, and even into the back. When people come into the office with low back pain or even knee pain, a lot of times we'll look at the glutes to see if they're functioning properly. If the glutes aren't functioning properly, it can cause abnormal stress in the knees as well as into the low back. Once we figure out if a muscle is too tight or weak, then we can start to incorporate either stretching or strengthening exercises to help stabilize or loosen the joint. Pain around the glutes can be a couple different things. If it's muscle pain, it could be due to trigger points or the muscles too tight. It could be due to a tendonitis. There could be a bursitis, which is inflammation around the area. There could be arthritis within the joint or a bone fracture. And it also could be nerve pain, which would be more of the sciatic type pain.